Welcome to our garden here at 142 Cramptons Road, Sevenoaks, Kent. It's only 30 feet long, but it's packed full of plants. It's a tapestry made of plants, and it's foliage that's key here to making a long lasting lush display. This film will feature some of my favourite plants, like this Aracema, Aracema speciosa magnificum. This one is Aracema galeatum. Mathiacella buproides with Oreopanax from Colombia. Crocodendron aralioides on the left. Wonderful large leaves of Aracema galeatum. We've created a sunken seating area so it really feels like we're immersed in plants. We can hide away in a cool green oasis that's become a haven not just for us, but for wildlife too. Full of texture, colour, shapes and tones. Transparent, elegant and graceful plants like Pseudopanax. Mulebeckia melianthus, Aeson aracema by the small pond. More Pseudopanax here by the seating area first of two small lawns, surrounded by lush foliage of Aces, Mahonias, Tuna sinensis, Ace of Palmatum, Tetrapanax. Another Pseudopanax, there's Sanguasorba lilac scroll in there, Cucura villosa, Alangi and Plantanifolium, rusty iron fern by Cranbrook iron. There's the seed heads of Acacia provisima, it's flowered splendidly this year, all spring. Doralia cordata poking up through the Mahonia soft caress. Fatsia polycarpa in front of the driftwood. The fence is painted urban slate, which really makes the leaves stand out. There's Osmunda regardless behind the driftwood. And we pan round here to sassafras, wonderful leaves, turned bright red in autumn. Euphorbia polycarpa is always covered with insects, bees and all manner of other things. It flowers on and on for very many months of the year, it's a great garden plant. Behind it, we've got Allium Summer Drummer and Oreo um, Oppopanax. Maruncus Horatio there, past Polygonatum Cirifolium, Desmodium elegans, which has the most wonderful soft leaves, so loved by leaf cutter bees. Jeffrey Chapana popping up there. And this year, we planted lots of alliums. This is Allium Christophii, nestling in amongst other more leaves of umbellifers, and the thrusting new leaves of the Abyssinian banana, of Pseudopanax ferox, with Rose Bay willow herb mingling in. More umbellifers, I love umbellifers, wonderful plants, wonderful stature and grace. Here from the North American prairies, a napier, and to the left, a Szechuan pepper. This is the view from the end of the garden, from the little arbour we have there. Lush, leafy, like in a jungle. And a view from the back gate where visitors would have entered this year. Popping up among things like Scheffler are, are these little alliums, Allium roseum. Here it's combined with Parotia persica. And Allium christophii, which has been so popular with the bees and insects. A 
thank you for visiting the garden, albeit virtually. I hope you enjoyed this little tour. Please consider donating to the National Garden Scheme via the link. Thank you.